is the news leader, ABC7 Eyewitness News. I'm Lauren Glassberg at a romantic table set for two, and coming up we'll show you how tea can stir the senses this Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day is fast approaching, and this week we've been offering some advice to spike the romance, everything from where to dine to where to pose. But tonight we are going to show you how to bring the romance home. Laura Glassberg is here with details. Well, if you haven't made a dinner reservation for Valentine's Day, forget about it. Valentine's is on a Saturday this year, and restaurants are booked up. They booked up months ago. So break out the lingerie, crank up the berry white, and try some of these techniques. You have to sit down and, you know, look at the person, talk. It gives you, like, a special time that you could share and have tea together. Take it from Tracy Stern. Tea brings people together. She met her husband at a tea salon and now owns Salon Tea at the City Club Hotel. She set the table for a little romantic steeping, but you can do the same thing at home, from heart-shaped stones to sandwiches. Everything is hand-cut, shaped like a heart, um, decorated to, to be just like eye-pleasing as well as, you know, taste terrific. Decorate the table with a vase of cranberries and flower buds and even put romantic images between glass plates. Serve up some tea infused with sexy scents like cardamom and cinnamon. <laughs> and how about some tea, folks? I made you some tea from... I have a question. Over here. I have a question. Yeah, you want those lips? No, well, yes, uh, does, the, uh, does the body art kind of like smear if you're smear? in like a you know, kind of a it, hugging it dries, situation? It dries, but... Um, Keep your distance okay. because it will. You so know, there is some rub some, and slide some, factor. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You can come touch, but yeah, it's okay. not extended. Touch. And I'm, I'm right. telling you, this is the romantic tea. Okay. Yeah. I but, thought we would spice up the newscast. Yeah, it's Sam needed a little romantic tea. <laughs> but if my husband pulls out the romance. Lipton on Valentine's Day, it's not going to cut it. <laughs> you need something to be romantic, and these yeah. these teas are infused with these great scents. Very nice. so. okay. Okay. It smells fabulous. Yeah, and you made them yourself, right? I you're falling in love right away, right? Yeah, yeah we love you, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Valentine's. <laughs> and I'm, I'm right. telling you. It's a romantic tea. Okay. Yeah. I but, thought we would spice up the newscast. Yeah, it's Sam lovely. needed a little romantic tea. <laughs> but if my husband pulls out the Lipton on Valentine's Day, it's not going to cut it. <laughs> you need something to be romantic, and these, yeah. these teas are infused with these great scents. Very nice. so. okay. Okay. It, it, it smells fabulous. Yeah. And you made them yourself, right? I know you're falling in love right away, right? Yeah, yeah. We love you, man. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Valentine's. <laughs> Good job.